Hello, my name is René Schulte and I work for a company called Identity Mine. I'm also a Windows Phone Development MVP, um, but today I'm going to show a kind of different hardware. Um, I'm going to show how to combine the Kinect sensor with the new Leap Motion device, right? So, uh, Kinect for Windows SDK 1.7 introduced a new API called Kinect Interaction and the controls. So, those APIs provide a very nice and easy way to implement really, really good uh, natural user interfaces. But as you might know, the Kinect, even with the near mode, the Kinect has this limitation that everything that's closer than 40 centimeters to its sensor, the Kinect cannot see it. It's basically blind in um, the depth of 40 centimeters, everything that's below that. So that's why I figured, okay, there's this new leap motion sensor, which you can actually place anywhere. So it might be useful to like close this gap, right? So that's what this demo is about. And the uh, leap motion sensor, it basically has the sensors up here in this panel and it, ev it sees everything that's above it, right? When I lay it on the ground, it sees everything that's above it in a certain, in a certain range, of course. I think it's like half a meter above it. And then it's an inverse pyramid. Um, yeah, so that's that's the demo I'm going to show here. Um, yeah, let's go. So that's the default um, Connect for Windows interaction sample, which you can see here. Um, and yeah, that's the that's the default Connect for Windows interaction sample that ships with the current SDK. So I can engage with the with the sample here, and the Connect for Windows interaction provides some nice gestures. Like uh, if I move my hand forward, I can initiate a press gesture, and even the grip. The grip is pretty cool. Close your hand, grip the scroll viewer, and scroll up and down. And if you open your hand, you will let it go. Right? That, that's very cool. But that's standard stuff. That's that's stuff that ships with the Connect for Windows interaction. Um, toolkit. So I'm now connecting the leap motion sensor. I Actually I could have connected it all the time. Uh, the interference with the infrared sensors of both is it's not that big and it actually works. But yeah. That's the same application running right here. And now I'm using my finger as you can see. Uh, move my finger around and you might see this little ball. So I use this, this ball here you can see in the application to uh, show the leap motion sensor, right? And I can even like uh, use some gestures like a quick move of the hand forward with my finger and that will initiate a tap, right? And works very, very nice as you can see, very precise and yeah, that's, that's just a quick hack and a proof of concept. But I think it shows that you can use the Kinect and the new Leap Motion Sensor technology to uh, provide natural user interfaces, um, which you know provide a better way for the user to engage with it, right? Yeah. So that's it. Thanks for joining. You can also find me on Twitter. It's at R S C H U. Goodbye.